。每次走过熟悉的街道，你和昨天还在这里停靠。那么多扇温暖的窗口，哪一个能收留我的微笑？曾经多少泛黄的美好，任由季节的风去平调，已经戒了往事的味道，我的心不会没。This development needs some attention. Its infrastructure is okay, but the security is poor. Residents complain a lot. Which development? Uh, the Willow Town. The Willow Town. I'll go take a look later today. Uh, there's no need, Mr. Gong. We can handle it. I live there for now. Last night, I noticed some general issues, fairly serious. But you have a board meeting at two and another at four with the Peng State Group executives. I know. I'll go after that. Don't let them know. It'll be a spot check.、Hmm. Okay. What's next? Why would you go to the development site in person? Je ne sais pas. Mr. Gong is very unconventional. I thought you knew him. <sighs> Sorry. Yeah. Are you free this weekend? I have tickets for a concert.、Uh, no, I'm sorry. On Saturday, I'm going to an event at Dongfang Business College with Mr. Gong. You can ask someone else, though. Uh. Are you free another time, like Sunday? You are a perfect guy. Why do you waste your time on me? Sorry, all the attention you pay to Mr. Gong. I wish someone was for me. Mr. Lu, I'm really sorry. I don't want to give you the wrong impression. I should be clear with you now. Have you read it? Name, occupation, hometown, birthplace, marriage record, education, star sign, blood type, and hobbies. Records are all very detailed. I think Shang Xiang has the ability to be a great spy. Feng Shang Shang is in her thirties and still isn't married. She must be waiting for her Mister Right to appear suddenly from somewhere. Maybe that's why she's so concerned with the details of these lists, like their backgrounds or so. We too need to be aware. At events like these, we should be sure we are not only doing our work; we're also showing ourselves to others. Are you serious? Of course. So now he doesn't mind. None of his business. We got divorced a long time ago. Anyway, the only reason we married was to combine my beauty with his intelligence to produce a perfect baby. Now I doubt how smart that decision was. <laughs> Let's eat. Just a sec. Hello. We're at the restaurant. Yes, with Sao Sao. Oh, you're so slow. Hurry up. Chop chop. Who's that? Sun Nanwei is cooking. What? 
He thinks that he'll live longer if he cooks healthy food from scratch, you know? So each day he makes soup, but he never finishes it. Yes. You love it. Who's in charge here, please? Who are you? I'm a resident here. I need to drive in. Didn't you hear me honking my horn? Bro, what's up? I just told you. I'm a resident. I need to get in. I beat my horn. You didn't hear it? Should you really be playing games while on duty? Bro, it's freezing outside. We're just having some fun, okay? <laughs> Ignore him, let's play. He can't fire me. What did you say? I said, I'm playing poker. You can't fire me. Want to drive in? Go ahead. Move the come yourself. Move it myself? You're out of your car. Move it yourself. Okay. Thank okay. you. Who was that? So annoying. Dude, doesn't he look really familiar to you? I'm the company leaflet. Bring it here, let me see. How about this one? No way, he's too old for me. Don't worry about it, he's old but rich. Hey, 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 hey guys, guys, Hi. guys, 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 hey, what's this? Work. Ah, uh, uh, waiter, please bring me uh, three bowls and a ladle. Ah, uh, thanks. I, uh, what can I get you? Uh, it, it's all right. Uh, this uh, is not healthy. Not healthy. Try this. Thank thanks. You. What is it made of? It's made of uh, soybean and pig's feet. Very nutritious. Huh? Uh, you know, uh, when ladies eat this, it's a uh, beauty treatment. Well, for a gentleman, it's, uh, it's just healthy. <laughs> <laughs> you two enjoy it. It's not for me. Uh... This is so bizarre, I can't even describe. You're divorced and drinking soup together. Uh, and we call this once family, always family. Even in divorce, we're still family. <laughs> not how hey. I see it. Hey. <sighs> what are you waiting for? Go pay the bill. Uh, well, won't you order anything else? No, we've had a lot. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. I'll, I'll go, I'll go. Tasty. Can't you be nicer to him? I'm nicer than usual. Thanks for the lift. Take care. Bye-bye. See you soon. See ya. Why are you here? I could ask you the same. <sighs> Did you come to see me? Apparently the other way around. Why would I do that? You don't live here. I came to see the snowman.
Last night... Last night it snowed a lot. Last night I drank too much. And I don't remember... I didn't drink at all. Huh? If you don't remember, it's all right. Nothing really happened. Nothing happened? You think nothing ever happened? Didn't you say that you don't remember? Did you want something to happen? Or nothing ever happened? Nothing would be great. So why'd you come here? I told you already. <laughs> to see the snowman. Are you a child? Come all this way just to see a snowman. All right. I did come to see you. Is that okay? Why are you so uptight? You were like this yesterday. You really don't remember? <laughs> Let me jog your memory. No big deal. We're both adults. I find you attractive. So maybe there's potential. If I feel so inclined, I'll give you a call. And then? And we'll play by these rules. We'll live our own lives. Oh. It's secret. And doesn't mean anything. Feelings should be mutual. And... That's it. Good. Comprehensive. And thorough, too. I don't want any drama anyway. Fine. I agree. Not tonight, though. I'm busy tonight. I'm busy, too. The sun rising from the west. The monk is checking out women. Who are you calling monk? I'm a man. I appreciate women's beauty. It's natural. <laughs> hey, let's go down. We can take a look. Huh? Look at what? Ladies, let's go. What do you say? Lift your arms, hands together on your chest. Wake up! We're not here for yoga! Take a deep breath. Secret with no strings attached. A good deal. If you don't get attached, then there's no risk of trouble. Two people having fun. Fantastic. And then? That depends. What else you want? Let's be clear. The secret here is not to get sentimental. Otherwise, the fun would be totally ruined. It really is a lot of fun. Hey. We're here. Hi. We're having fun, too. Hey, Hi. come here, come sit. This is Gongjian. Uh. Fair. Ah, Fair. Hello. Um, hello. Hi. You're the one who threw the yoga ball at me, right? Oh, sorry about that. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Hey, now I'm intrigued. What were you trying to do? It slipped. Why does it seem like I don't exist? 
Fine, fine. Uh, I will leave. Well, where should I go? I changed my mind. Go on, I bring the girls out, but they only seem interested in you. I've said this before. I think we are natural competitors in life. What competition? I'm going. But, hey, you I'm have joking. Fun. Stay. Stay. I got things to do. Do you? Yes, really. I do. Okay. Hey, give me his number. Sure. Go on then. As long as you keep mine, okay? Hey, hey, did you hear the news? A man from head office came here yesterday. The security guards were caught playing poker. It's pretty bad. That explains why yesterday I heard people knocking at the desk in the manager's office. Did you see Mr. Gong? Isn't he handsome and manly? I've heard that he's still single. The four security guards playing poker at the security office must all be fired, and the security manager disciplined. Mr. Liu, what are your thoughts? The guards have been complacent lately. That's my responsibility. I'll have a meeting with all the security staff. The Willow residence houses 4,750 families. The population is over 14,000. This project needs to be running more effectively if we're to meet industry standards. As for the security, it's top priority to fix this right away. But what did our guards do? They saw unidentified people in and out, but didn't bother to question or register anyone. Do they know how to do their job? They are the guardians of this community, shouldering responsibilities. This was very disappointing. I'm responsible for that. Mr. Liu, find me a security uniform. Tell the guards to gather in the community square. Stop! Stomach in! Straighten up your chest. You hear me? At ease! Which foot, huh? Huh? I don't know. You don't know? You call yourself a guard? Left foot. Uh, uh. Watch me demonstrate. Pay attention. Attention! At ease! Attention! Eyes turn left! Eyes forward! Turn right! Look at yourselves. You almost fell over. Turn left! I'll demonstrate this one more time. Concentrate! Turn right! Turn right! Is that all clear? That guy you introduced me to, Gong Jian, he really works at Bayal Estates? It's 4,980 yuan. Cash or card, sir? Make it cash. Dear Xiaomin, how many times have I told you? I take my coffee with milk and sugar. Where is the milk and the sugar? Huh? Did you finish all of it? Mr. Sun? Do you know Gong Jian? The executive of Beiao Group? Are you sure he's an executive? I've heard Li Wen mention it. He was Li Wen's uh, brother-in-law. In a way, he and I were brothers. <laughs>
Gong Jian is a security guard. Training them? <laughs> that can't be. We were all fooled. All right, all right. Don't panic yet. I'll help. Relax. I'll find it out, all right? I gotta go. Bye. The company is making some adjustments to focus on the Huan properties. I believe we need not only to assess the value of resources, but also resolve problematic things, such as the property management arm of the company. It's problematic and not profitable. Can we transfer these duties to a third company? Our company began as a property management firm. I think this part should be preserved. These problems must be resolved. Deserting responsibilities could harm our reputation. Then security requires better training. No problem. I'll train them myself. Uh, what about the work here? I have confidence that you and Mr. Liu can run the company. Miss Chow can direct any other business issues to me at home. I can handle them from there. I don't think this should be a problem. Okay, I got it. I think that's all for today. Gong Qian, what's going on? Gong Xiao Xiao says she saw you in her community, dressed as a security guard. Are you changing occupations or what? I saw her too. I was rectifying some security issues and training the guards. She saw me there, then she just walked off. What's up? Ah, so she was confused. About what? She thought you were a security guard. She was very anxious when she called me. I remember she was emotional, almost crying. She thought I was security? About to cry? Of course. When I told her about you, I said you were an executive of a big company. I didn't say anything about security. <laughs> I get that. She will only go out with people she knows. Successful people. Don't think of Xiao Xiao that way. She's not like that. Gong Jian, tell me the truth. What's going on with you and her? Nothing's going on. We went out a few times. A few times? That means there's some kind of spark between you. I don't know. We're going with the flow. Okay, when I see Xiao Xiao again, I'll explain this all to her. No, don't you do that. Her thinking I work in security is really interesting. If she's willing to date me even as a guard, that's much more fun. Are you serious? Xiao <laughs> Xiao and I are best friends. I can't do that. Do it as a favor, okay? It's more fun than saying I'm the boss of a company in every single situation. A favor? Okay. I will, but I need your help too. For what? Your company is looking for legal representation. Will you consider Sun Nunway's firm first? Ah, so you're all concerned with this deal. <laughs> we will all benefit. Okay. I'll think about it. It's a deal then. You have my word that to Dung Xiao Xiao, you are a guard. Whatever happens, you're a guard. Turn right! Sao Sao, where's my coffee? Uh. Oh God! My God! Uh. What's wrong with her exactly? Mr. Liu. Yes. From today on, I'm gonna work from here during the day. You want to work here? Yes. But relax, I don't need your office. Just assign me a locker in the security office. And get me some security uniforms. For who? For me. It's not so strange. In the army, it refers to an experienced life from the bottom. An effective strategy. You got me? Uh, I'll call you Mr. Gong. Gong. Also, don't call me Mr. Gong. Call me Captain. Security captain. I'm the security captain. Not as of now. Now you're vice captain. Then I'll call you captain. Good. As long as you don't call me Mr. Gong. Give me your vehicle. We don't have a car. Isn't that your motorcycle outside the office? Do you really want the motorcycle? Yes, I do. Can you drive one? In the army, I was a helicopter pilot. You think I don't know how to ride a motorcycle? Thank you. 
Stay vigilant. Guard residents. Strengthen bodies. Guard residents. Strengthen bodies. Guard residents. Stay vigilant. Guard residents. Strengthen bodies. Guard residents. Hop. Turn left. I know that you're from different places because of your speech. We have different characters and different backgrounds, but we're all here to serve the same cause. We're destined to meet. We are all men with guts. We need to be vigilant. From today on, I will be your leader. From now on, we'll train together every day. I'll lead you myself. Are we clear? Yes, sir. Are we clear? Yes, sir. Good. Attention. Turn right. Keep up. Run three laps of the community. Ready? Go. The other day when it was snowing, I, I saw that woman with the captain. <laughs> What a coincidence. What's this? Why are you giving this back? If I knew you were a guard, I wouldn't have taken your money. How much do you earn a month? Three grand? Four grand? This is one month's salary of yours. It is. Now that you know I'm a guard, you must regret being with... Oh, stop it. I've returned your money. I thought I knew you. But we're strangers from now on. Hey, don't go. Don't touch me. You know I'm a guard, so now you don't want to see me, right? I've been very nice to you. Don't make me regret it, okay? I don't understand. So tell me. I want to know the reason. Aren't you embarrassed? Your lies are exposed and you don't even feel shame? So you borrowed a suit. And also a car? Just to impress me on a date? Why would you do that, and what are you up to? I am ashamed. I'm sorry. I was wrong to do that. But I did it because of my situation. The security company is owned by the president of Baal. My comrade from the army. I was his driver, but we had an accident. I mean, it was my fault. I was drunk driving. After that, he sent me here to be the captain of the security team. He's a good friend. People like me, without much education, find it hard to find decent work. But I still want to be loved. I can't stop looking for my true love just because of this, right? I don't buy one word of this. Why do you think I made this up? Are you used to always lying to women? Hey. That's not how it is. Shame on you. Sorry, what? What is the meaning of your anger? You disappointed because I'm not what you thought? Am I right? <laughs> I'm disappointed. <sighs> Just remember, from today now, stay away. You should be disappointed. I never thought he was capable of this behavior. People can always surprise you. Uh, Sal, do you still want to date him now? You seem a bit overreacted. I just can't ignore the injustice. Huh? The behavior of lying to women into bed. Now I'm wondering how many others he's tricked. Huh? From my knowledge, he has hardly dated anyone in years. I doubt it. He only wants to get girls into bed. Wait, what did you guys really get up to? Stop the nonsense. We only ate together and talked. I hate people lying to me more than anything. When I was together with Gao Hao, he lied to me constantly. After I discovered he was lying, I couldn't figure out when he was telling the truth and when he wasn't. Lies hurt people, however minor they may be. Okay. Hello? Miss Fung, I'm just downstairs. Okay, I'm on my way. 
I have to go. Miss Fung needs me. Is Miss Fung pushing you around? No, she's actually a nice person. It's only a poker face that she used to hide it. Wait, wait, wait. So, is it completely over with Gong Xian? There was nothing to begin with. I don't want to see him anymore. Bye. Miss Fong, I'm back. Come on in. Try these on. For the coming event. Wow. <sighs> so pretty. It's for me? It's rented. And you need to pay. May I ask to return it back? No way. We are representing our own firm. We have to show them that we have style, poise, and class. It's too revealing for me to wear. Can I try that one on? This is for Li Wen. It has a push-up bra. I don't think that you need it. Ah, oh, well, Li Wen has a really good figure. Huh? Wow, so pretty. Put it down. Oh. Leave here. Oh. Na, 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 na. No, wait. Something for you. Can you hire a car for us? Your car will not help us look good. Uh, I'll take this then. I, I'll hire one now. Mr. Gong. Mr. Gong, how's your work been lately? It's fine. The security work is unnecessary. It takes up too much time. Give the work to someone else. Don't worry. I can handle it. <sighs> what time is the event tonight? Seven o'clock. We should leave around... with him. Miss Fung, he's yours. No problem. Please introduce Tao Tao to the media. Got it. I'll take care of her. Liwen! Liwen! Um... Oh, see? Uh, this is a bit too revealing. Hey! Uh, Get off of me. My phone is dying. Get the power pack from the car. Go! Uh, oui, madame. So cute. You like him? He's yours. <laughs> This is the organizer of the event, Han Bing, also the executive director of Dongfang Business College. Han Bing. Mm. Thank you. Thanks. Life is like a blanket with the lines of suffering and happiness intertwined. If I remember it correctly, this is from your new book, Eternal Apollo, your favorite quote of Nietzsche's. Miss Jo, you have read my book? <laughs> Yes, yes, yes. Do you have any comments? Mr. Hunt, please excuse us. Sure, thank Thanks. you. Your book is of remarkable depth. It's not just me. Many girls are actually into it. Really? I thought the book's like mine, Miss Jo. Uh, that must be the waiter. Right. I'm a little hungry. Shall we go eat something? Uh, sure, it's all ready to serve. Miss, would you like to try some? Uh, thank you.
Do you like the suit and tie I prepared? It's great. Thank you. The CEOs of Longsheng Estate and Fuxing Estate are both here today. I've spoken to their secretaries, so you should speak to them tonight. Mr. Gong, here you go. Hello. Hello, I haven't seen Hello. you for a while. Hello. Surely we haven't. Oh, hi. Sure. Sure. Nice to meet you. Nice to hi. meet you. Hi. Mr. Gong. Nice oh, hello. hello. Mr. Gong, ah. your partner is so pretty. Ah. Thank you. See you. See you. Uh, Mr. Gong, here you are. We're all waiting for you. Hey, you don't have to be so polite. How are you doing? I'm fine. Not as good as you, I'm sure. <laughs> You're kidding. <now. laughs> we should have a drink later. No problem. It's a deal. Oh, deal. <laughs> Mr. Gong, I didn't know you were here. Miss Zhou. Hi, Miss Xiao. You look so pretty. Are you all prettier? Mr. Gong, you have such a beautiful woman with you. Do you know how many women here will be heartbroken? I'm flattered. Hey, Xiao Ren, give me a red wine. Sure, excuse me. Gong Jian, didn't you say you don't attend events like this? The organizer's a friend of mine. He invited me. I had to come. Dong Xiao Xiao is also here. Did you know? I saw him. What do we do? You tell me. It's not like I... <laughs> I'll arrange a time, okay. I'm sorry. Miss Chow handles all of my appointments. Speak with her. Ah, I see. Miss Dong, my company is preparing to apply for foreign patents. I'm wondering if you can advise me about intellectual property. Which countries are you thinking of applying to? Our company can certainly help you with this. It's a tricky area. Bear with me a sec. Waiter. Sorry. 
I think I'm gonna take off. This is really boring. It's really not a good time to go. Some more CEOs want to meet with you. Why don't you take a break in one of the rooms? I'll tell you when you need it. I wonder if Mr. Han is interested in going to the ball this weekend. Is Mr. Joe going too? We could go together. <laughs> sure, sure. I've looked for you everywhere. Ah. This is your. My girlfriend. Uh -huh. Oh, you make a great couple. Thank you, honey. Can I borrow you for a second? Sure. Excuse us for a second. Let's have a toast. Cheers. Cheers. Ms. Dung, let's go somewhere quiet to have a chat. Sure. This way. The rooms here are very quiet. Our conversation won't be disturbed. Uh, here, this is good. I don't think it's proper. Maybe we can talk out there. Ms. Dung, the atmosphere in here will be much better and quieter. Don't worry. It's all right. This way. Miss Dung, please. You see? This room is decorated very nicely. It's the VIP room. Have a seat. Miss Dung. You are... Very talented and beautiful. Being a paralegal in a law firm is kind of a waste of your talent. Uh, not at all. I quite like my job. Chung Dan Fong 